Okay, these are just two recordings that I've done where I've been speaking to a couple of Muslims. And basically, it's about the um, story in Surah 18, which is about Dua Al-Qurnayn, and it's to do with uh, where the sun sets. So if you listen to the two recordings, and basically, what I'd say is just make up your mind about what you think um, about whether the um, the story that's in the Quran is actually the truth or um, or it's not. But of course, uh, both of them would s- try to say that there's no mistakes in the Quran. But essentially, I've just done these recordings so that you can make up your own mind. I'm not really going to go on about them too much. So just listen to what these two Muslims say and just compare what they say and and maybe try and sort of think about why what they're saying each of them says is so different. Okay, so here comes the recording. So, so this is Surah 1883. Yeah. Yeah. So they, they asked you concerning Dula Khanane saying, I will rehearse to you something of his story. Verily, we established his power on earth and we gave him the ways and the means to all ends. Yeah. One such way he followed until when he reached the setting of the sun, he found it set in a spring of murky water. Near it he found a people who said, O oh, Dal Kwane, thou hast authority, either to punish them or to treat them with kindness. He said, Whoever doth wrong, him shall we punish. Then shall he be sent back to his Lord, and he will punish him with the punishment unheard of before. But whoever believes and works righteousness, he shall have a goodly reward, and easy will be his task as we order it by our command. Um, It continues. Then followed he another way, until when he came to the rising of the sun, he found it rising on a people for whom we found it rising on a people for whom we who we had provided no covering protection against the sun he left them as they were we completely understood what was before him okay well, I suppose you could leave it there because he's talking so the, the what I'm wondering is when he says the setting of the sun where is that the setting of the sun yeah and where is that? And where is that? Okay, so so basically, the the place where it sets is is a spring of murky water. The place that it sets is a spring of murky water. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Where did the sun start from? Somewhere? Yeah. Where did it start on the west? Right, and so at where it goes down in in the west is a spring of murky water. I don't know where it's set, but it just set. It arrives in London. Yeah. It arrives in London. It arrives from somewhere, and it will set to somewhere. If you bring London to the ground, okay. So, so is this a true story? Yeah, it is. It is. Oh, is that your point? All right. So, so, so then where is where is the spring of murky water? Where is the spring of murky water? Where was that? Where is it? Where is it now? Yeah, because this is the truth. So, where is the spring of yeah. You will find it around there, yeah, around yeah. the Arabia Peninsula but, and the at the yeah. Israelite site. Yeah, That's yeah, where you're going to find, you'll find them. And what's it called? I don't know what it's called, but what I'm saying to you, what did I explain here is about the nation. The nation what is it? Yeah. 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 What? What? The nation. What? What? Yeah. Right. <laughs> right, but you say this is the truth from Allah. So when he says a spring of murky water, that means that exists. And it's yeah. a physical place. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I've not been, so, I've not been there. So basically, so if we go to this spring of murky water, we will find the people who we can speak to. Who we can speak to there? Yeah. I'm not sure, I don't know. <laughs> right. But this... Many nations have been destroyed before Prophet Muhammad came. We, many nations have been destroyed before mm-hmm. Prophet Muhammad came. Right. People like Suleiman and Gomorrah, you mm-hmm. want to go there to go and find out about them, you can't find them there. Mm-hmm. They were destroyed. Right. Which would so, have Genesis chapter 19. Okay. They were destroyed. So, so now, does the sun set in a spring of murky, uh, in a spring of murky water? Is that is that where the sun sets now? It doesn't say. No, it's like it's like the sun coming from here and it went to set down here. Right. No, so, so, no, no, in the water. Okay, so what the water was there. So what you described there is different from what it says here. So the way it, the way it sets now is different from here. 
The way he said then. No, the no, way the way he says no, now. Different. The way he said now. I, 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 how does he say now? Well, he goes down over the horizon. That's what I'm saying. No, no, he rises from somewhere from the east. Then he goes to set at the west. Yeah. Let me give you one of these chapters. Where was this land? Where was this land? Where was this land? Where was this land? Without Africa? No, no, no. You saw the man. I'm with you on that. I'm with you on the same page. Yeah, perfect. He didn't reach out. I have to go now. Mm -hmm. After the, I have to go then. Wait. Are you free tomorrow? Uh, no, it really just has to be next, no, ne next week. No, 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 because I've got work to do. Next week what? Hmm? Next week what? No. Well, if um, I mean, I was down here from half three. No, was it? No, I was here from half two actually. But, but, but yeah, but you turned up late. The Lord of the two east, mm. place the east where the sun rise. Mm. Places of the sun rise during the early summer and the winter time where they rise. And the Lord of the two west, places of the sun during the early summer and the early winter. Right. So they set from the east, they went to the west to set. They right. rise from the east. They went to the set. There might be spring of water there. That is why it's revealed in the Quran. Yeah, but it does say, say in a spring of murky, murky water. So, 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 so that's. You went to set. Done. Yeah. And that place, what do you want to do about it? What do you want to say about it? What do you want to bring out of that? No, we what? all know that we all know that the sun rises from somewhere yeah, and it sets to somewhere. Mm. We all know that in right. London we live in today. We know it rises from the east and it sets on the west. Right, but no, but it's just the fact. The no, it's just the fact that Allah said that this yeah. dual call name. No, the only thing that is. No man. I have more time now. My wife is calling me. I have oh, to take care of some. All right. Time. Maybe when when should we see again? Mm. Three times. Why should we meet here again? You, 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 well, it has to be next week because I've got five. What, huh? what, you mean ta ta what, timing? Oh, no, no, just Saturday again. Saturday? Yeah, because I've got work on for the week. Are you going to tell him then? Who did you name? Yeah. Who did you name? Yeah. The rest of the... I know you have any question regarding the Quran. Thank you! Yeah, yeah, well, they are various ones, but... Thank you! Thank you! Some are, uh, you could say, probably easier for you to explain than others. You're trying to relate. No, the one I'm talking about, mm. why are we trying to find out that we are the sun set? We are the sun rise. The whole knows. If you are the scientist, they will tell you the sun rise from the east and the sun on the west. No. Yeah, but if Allah says someone that it's in a spring of murky water, you'd think that's exactly where it would set. Yes. Right, so that means we should be able to find the spring of murky water. Yeah, if you, if you try to make a research on it, you can find it. Hmm? If you make, if you're trying to make a research on that, you can find it. Yeah, but the thing about it is, if, if the sun's going down, I mean, this is reality. If the sun's going down and you're riding towards it, will you actually get to where it sets in in the ground? Yeah, if you can do that. No, 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 no. Are you saying that's possible? Sorry. Are you saying that's possible? That's right. Try hmm? to make a research on that. Yeah, but Before you can make a conclusion on that, you have to make a research. What about the Bar Bar yeah. sunset? Any, what? What? If you are making, what if you are making, look at this one, look at this. There's no sun chapter 41. No, no, sunset is time. No sun is sunset. No, it's time, time what? period. Sunset is sunset. Quran 41. When the sun go down, isn't it? And it turned out. Quran 41, verse 37. You know, like you divide the day from the night, the sunset. sunset. I'll speak to you on the phone. Yeah, no, 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 that's good. No, that's fine. No, I'm not talking to you, man. Just talk to him, that's fine. 37. We can talk another time. This is a big fight here. No, no, no. So we just we're trying to dialogue as the Bible says. Yes, no, I know. Yes. Alright, sir. Where's the Bible here? So Quran is lost because we are not now we are Okay, so Hindus can come to you and they say you rejecting their scripture, so you are wrong. Because you are against Hindus. Oh, wait, wait, so wait, if wait, everybody is judged by the whole, let me understand. Wait, wait, you need, oh, you need to show let me, me understand what you're you saying. Need to show wait, me wait, the first, first. Let me I'll understand. I'll show you. You want to see yeah, the error? Yeah, please, let me come on. He's going to show. Wait, my friend, listen, listen. My friend is going to show you the error. Wait, wait, wait. What Quran give us that uh, falsification test? It says, right. if this book is from anybody other than Allah, yes. there's bound to be a contradiction in it. All That's right. a falsification test of the Quran. So does Bible also say that. Bible also say that in Matthew chapter 24 verse 35, okay. the God's word will not pass away. 
meaning God will yeah. Same, same part, the Ten Commandments. But, 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 but you what you said. Yes. The Ten Commandments oh. do not pass away. Yeah. Yeah. No, God word. So you're telling only Ten Commandments are the power of God's word? The rest of it is not a God word? <laughs> That's why he's saying that. We're telling you the main He's telling you God's word. You main, it, no, it doesn't, it doesn't say Ten Commandments. Okay, okay, okay. He's going to read it. Okay, okay. Gonna, my friend is so we, we my agree, friend is we agree the Bible has added. My friend is reading. My friend is reading. Yes, yes, yes. yes, yes. You listen? I am listening now. All right. This is Surah 18. Yes. Verse 83. About the sun. Yeah. Talk about the sun. Yeah. yeah. Okay. What they, it says about it? They asked you concerning Dor Kanan. Yes. Say, I will rehearse to you something of his story. Right. Early we established his power on earth and we gave him the ways and means to all ends. Yeah. One such way he followed until when he reached the setting of the sun, yeah. he found it set in a spring of murky water. Right. Near it he found the people who said, Oh Dor Kanan, thou hast authority either to punish them or to treat them with kindness. He said, whoever does wrong, him shall we punish, then shall we be sent back to his Lord, and he will punish him with the punishment. I think you made your point. Well, yeah. Your point was, sun was setting in the murky water. Yeah. So, uh, one, one, one minute. No, no, let, let, let him finish. Okay, don't let, let, let him finish. Let him finish. No, the question is the Quran. Yeah. Even Bible is wrong, we have to defend the Quran. So why are you going to the Bible? No, we are not going to the Bible. We are not going to the Bible. We are going to defend the Quran. We don't. Now, now put your question to everybody what Quran's mistake is. Hmm? What Quran's error is. He says, making a simple language. What was the Quran that there is? So God Kanain, he went. He found the setting. He went to the setting of the sun yeah. and found it set in a spring of murky water. Or I make it easy. He's saying that the Quran is saying, yeah. Allah is saying the yeah. sun is setting in the murky water. Or Allah is not saying that. What Allah is saying? I tell you. I tell you what is there. I tell you. Brother, brother, you brother, listen. Listen. Brother, this is a, brother, this, brother, this is a very childish behavior. Very childish behavior. When I say that, I'm going to back it up. What Allah is saying is, brother, 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 what Allah is saying is, when Zulkar Nan reached the setting of the sun, place of setting of the sun, he found it setting in the murky water. What he said, he found it. Allah never say sun setting in the murky water. He said he found it. For example, when I'm standing here by the sunset, I'll found the sun setting behind the trees. Okay, all right. What that means? That is my uh, my understanding. Understand. So what I'm seeing is Allah never say the sun setting in the murky water. He say he found it. So when he saw it, he found it. For example, you found something easy. Same thing I found it uh, difficult. It's our own interpretation, our own understanding of the thing. That's what Allah is saying that he found it. Not that he said. I just quote you from John. You said that it was just a quotation. Who is John? How can you interpret that for me? Can I answer? Yeah. Can I answer that? Yes. Yeah, uh, what my question was? I said John saying that, not Jesus. But you are saying this. Not uh, no, 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 it's no, 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 no. He's Allah saying it. Allah saying it. Contradict yourself. Where? Where? How? You told how? us that you, you, we could quote from John because it wasn't John. You are now explaining to my colleague what kind of question. If you allow me, if you allow me, every time I speak, somebody else starts yeah. speaking. Okay. When I say that this is a John's word, how you trust it? He said, I trust my Bible. Then I ask you a question, do you believe there is an error in the Bible? You say no, he said no, he said yes, there are errors in the Bible. Yeah, he did, he did. So what I say, what I'm saying is, when you know, when you know there are errors in the Bible, how can you trust every single word? On the other hand, on the contrary, Quran has not a single error. So that's why we need. Now this, now this is not an error. This is not an error. Allah is telling us, since he's our brother, let me, since he's our Lord, he can see exactly what you're seeing right now. Sorry about that. He can see through everybody because he's our Lord. He's, he's, uh, he has a knowledge of everything. So he can see what he was perceiving, what Zulkarnan was perceiving. He found his sun setting in the mature, like you're standing by the seaside. You see the sun getting into the in the water. All right, all right. So that's what he saw. Allah never say sun was setting in the murky water. Right, then then there will be error. Okay. So this is this, this is not a contradiction. Okay, I'll ask you one question. That explanation you just gave yeah. is that the same one Muhammad gave? Like what? As you just ex explained Let's see what Muhammad, the let's see what what Muhammad explained. Let's see what I know what you're talking about. Okay. Yeah, you're talking about the hadith of uh, Abu Dar. Yeah. Abu Dar hadith, yeah? Right. Now this hadith has been narrated by three people. This hadith has been narrated by three people. Same hadith. You know hadith, sometimes different companions. Mm. Now one of them says that, that uh, Muhammad Sallallahu told, do you know where the sun set? He said Allah and his messenger knows best. He says sun set in the pool of murky water. One hadith. The same hadith, two other narrate. What they say? Do you know where the sun set? 
He said Allah and His Messenger know best. He said the sun set under the throne of Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. Didn't say murky water. The Bible cannot, so, the Quran so, cannot so, trust so. The no, 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 no. What Bible? The Quran cannot. No, we talk about Hadith here. Because it's two no, different. No, no, Hadith. It's two different commentary. Hadith. The Quran of no, Islam. Hadith. We're talking about a Quran. Wait, no, wait, Quran wait, just wait. simply no. made a statement. What he found. But hadith are different, and we, we, so we never say, brother, we never say hadith are perfect. We never say hadith are perfect. Quran is perfect. Brother, our textbook is the Quran, not the hadith. So hadith, I give you, there are two different commentaries, and one of them say in this murky water. Two, two of them say that no, if he doesn't know that. Two of them they say it goes under the throne of Allah. If you don't, if you don't know that, I can show you. Yeah, okay. I can show you. That. So what you're saying is the throne of Allah is in this reality. No, but, but but the sun is in this reality. So if it sets, it, that means that no, the sun no, no, is no, in no, this no, reality. No. But sun is in the end where it's going to go. We're talking about eventually, that's eventually. Not what, that's not what no, saying. the hadith, hadith saying that. Hadith eventually is going to go under the throne of Allah. So that means that hadith is not talking about this verse. Then. This verse isn't talking about at the end. This verse is talking about hadith. Now. Hadith is just saying. Hadith is not talking about this verse. Hadith never say this is the interpretation of this word. Read the hadith. He never said I'm interpreting chapter 18 and that. No, he just merely telling where the sun going to go set, and that's what we believe. Sun is heading to you know the apex. What they call it? Where the, the scientists are telling us sun is heading to one direction. What does it give any direction? Huh? So many water could be north, east, south, or west. You can, you can hear the muddy, muddy water. No, you can hear the southwest. No, no. If you trust him, you couldn't. You couldn't. You thought the sun actually set in a pool of water to write the Quran. To write the Quran. Allah is not saying that. I'm telling you. Allah didn't say that. When, when he reached, when he, wrote it, when he reached the place, no. Who wrote it? He's telling you a story. He's telling you a story. Like me, I'm not telling you your hair. I'm telling you a story about the man. He walked in and he go there. And he 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 didn't say. I'm telling you, son, said here. He said he, 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 he found it. He found it. He perceived it. He perceived it. Okay. Huh? More than sun. More than sun. More, more than more than sun. Context is they read the Zulkan and was a king. He was conquering places. He reached okay. one place. And when he reached that place, he found sun setting in the murky water. Basically, the sun set sun. So he said, No, no, he said, He never said, He never said, Sun was setting it. He said, He found it. That's a very important point. He found it. Meaning, he perceived it. He found it. That's a very good point. All the Muslims will not interrupt it. Okay, bring any Muslim. Bring any Muslim. Bring any Muslim. Bring any Muslim. Okay, okay. Do you, have you, have you spoken, have you spoken to Muslims about that? Have you? Yeah, okay, yeah. tell me no. the common answer. No, no, no I, I can give you the answer. Tell me the common I, I, answer. I spoke to a Muslim yesterday. Yeah, what did he say? I asked him, where was the body with the water? He actually said it was on the earth somewhere. <laughs> they're, 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 I've actually got it recorded. I'll, I'll, I'll get the recording. Hang on, did I say... One minute. Yeah. You're just saying you spoke to a Muslim yeah. and you asked him where's the pool of muddy water. Yes. And he says on the earth. Yeah. And, and one minute, one minute. Did I say it's not on the earth? Huh? Did I say pool of muddy water is not on the earth? So, so Did I say that? No. I say pool of muddy water in the earth, and I'm saying he saw it setting in the in there. He perceived it. I'm not denying it. Right. So then, why is this other Muslim? Why did he say it actually has a location on the earth? What relation? Sun? No, no. He. I asked him where is it. He actually told me it had a location. Yeah. So. Yeah. So, so, so then, how come you're disagreeing, brother? I'm not disagreeing. Right. I'm saying yeah, there's no, a pool of muddy water with Zulkan and Reach, no, okay. and he found his sun setting in there. Meaning, he perceived it. Like I give you example. I'm going to find the sun setting behind the tree. Is it setting behind the tree, or does sun ever set? No. It's our perception. Right. Our perception that sun sets. Sun actually doesn't set anywhere. It's our perception. So he found it, he saw it, he perceived it. That's what it is. Right. It's not saying that sun was actually setting it. No. So you're wrong here. Other than the sunset, other than the water, other than anything, Christ is creator. You believe or not? Show me another contradiction. Okay. So that, that is not a contradiction. We just prove it. You, 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 you believe it or not believe it? That's not a contradiction. Right. So you're not going to answer why the other Muslim answered it in that way. Well, I'm agreeing. That there's a pool of muddy water on the earth. So what? So, so, so you know where it is? I don't know where it is, but there's there's on the earth. So what? There are many pools of muddy water on the earth. So what? Okay. Well, so since it's in the Quran, why why don't you show us where it is and then we'll know? No, why why do I have to show? The Quran is not a book of geography, you know. Hmm? 
Quran is not a book of geography. I'm not denying it is somewhere in pool of muddy water. So what? It's in the east or in the west, wherever it is, there is a pool of muddy water warm. So what? Alright, so that doesn't prove anything. So, so if you're so confused about this verse, why did Allah put it? There's no confusing. There's no confusing at all. But it sounds confusing. No Muslim ever believed the sun set actually in the water. Okay. No Muslim but, ever believed that. But you just said I'm not even a learner scholar of non-Muslim. You don't believe Christ uh, as a son of God. You don't believe. No, he's not. As a God, you don't believe. Well, according as to the Bible, according to the Bible, there are many, many sons of God. As a creator, how do you believe? Huh? Jesus Christ is the creator. How do you believe? He's a creator. Okay. You know the definition of creator? Creator, who's creator? All knowing, All Om, omnipresent, who made? Yeah, omniscient. Okay. Yes, that's who that's the definition of it. Who made? Can you create something? Who made? Can you create something? Can you create something? Answer. Can you create something? Can you create something? Can you create something? Can you create something? Yes. Looks like he saved you, huh? Yes. Ah, uh, he saved you from. There's no saving me. I'm here. You're proving nothing. Why? 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 What you are proving nothing. You want me to tell you where exactly the water is? Yeah. That has nothing to do with it. wherever it is. So what? Right. So, so wherever it is. So what you're saying is that this story yes. is it real or is it a myth? Well, it's definitely real. It's not a myth. Of no. course, it's a real story. Okay. So then, your your um people who teach you, they should since it's in the Quran, they should tell you where it is. No, that is my own research if I want to, but that is nothing to do with my my theology of, of Quran or understanding the Quran. I don't have to know where the pool of muddy water is because there's the sunset every day yeah. in the sea or wherever. So this is not important for us where was that pool of muddy water. The pool of muddy water is not important at all in that story. It's not. He's just telling he reached a place mm -hmm. and it was a pool of muddy water and he saw sun, he found, not saw, he found sun setting in the pool of muddy water. So it's nothing to do for us to find out where the pool of muddy water is. What has to do with it? Well, that's easy. Why? If you find the pool of muddy water yeah. and you see the sun setting in it, and you know 100% the crowd is true. You have to find it. You have to no. show, okay, I found pool of muddy water and sun doesn't set there. All right, so I want to become a Muslim. So I find this verse and I say, oh, I want to become a Muslim. So if they could show me where the stream of muddy water is. Do your own research. Well, you can ask some scholar. I don't know. I don't know where the pool is. So, so no, you, so you're going to throw my question No, away. I'm not. No. Yeah, ask some scholar who know where exactly the location of this place is. But the whole point of this verse is not about the location. Uh -huh. Many times Allah says Muhammad went there. He had a war. He had done a battle. So yeah. we don't go, ah, tell me where exactly that battle was. I need to see exactly the place. I want to find out. Moses went to the uh, mountain. Mm -hmm. to I don't have to say, oh, I need to see the mountain. If I don't see the mountain, I'm not going to believe in the Quran. No. You have to show us. There is no. Now, what are you supposed to do? Mm -hmm. You have to prove there is no single pool of muddy water in the earth. So, Quran is wrong. There is no single pool of muddy water in the earth. So, Quran is talking nonsense. So, since if you prove that, then you are right. Because I'm saying there are many pools of muddy water. No, but I think you don't realize what he's saying. He's saying the sun is setting in the pool. No, he is not saying that. You rather, you he say he found it. Yeah. He found it, meaning he perceived it. Mm. Like I give you an example. I found sun setting behind the trees. That doesn't mean he's setting there. Because I saw it, I perceived it. That's what he's talking about. But you're ignoring the fact they say he found it. He's not saying that it, he, it was setting. So, so when he says in, does he say does he say in in the Arabic or something else? I'm not an Arabic speaking person, but it says in, so it's so in. Yes. Yeah, that, that in is different from over. If something goes over a pool, it disappears behind the horizon. If it goes in the pool, you see it actually go in. Yeah, but when we go to the sea, mm -hmm. yeah, our body perceives. We see sun setting in, so the inside the water, mm -hmm. in the sea. Mm -hmm. That is our perception. That's Allah saying that. He found it setting in. Not Allah saying that sun was setting in the pool of muddy water. Right. It's a perception. In perception, I see sun setting behind the trees. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's not really behind the trees, it's on the other, it's not actually even setting. Well, it's, a, a, it's a perception. Well, here's an easy one. If you're going across a landscape and the sun is going down, do you ever get to where it is on the horizon? Yeah, the same way, you, same way, if you, were, if you were up on the other side of the pool of spring water, he found that it was not. Right. So, Simple so, answer. Okay, so basically, the pool, you're saying the pool was all the way on the horizon somewhere. Well, we believe, many people say, we believe it was the ocean. Some people say, maybe that Muslim who told you that, he say he was actually the full of for Allah, even like when he say cross the pond. Mm -hmm. 
From UK, America is just across the pond. Yeah. Not really a pond, it's a sea, mm -hmm. big ocean. So when Allah is saying a pool, mm -hmm. it's not really a pool. Mm -hmm. It might be a Mediterranean Sea when he reached. Yeah? Maybe he reached reach Atlantic, who knows? It was the ocean. Yeah? Or maybe the temperature of the ocean was warm. So in, right. in, the, uh, in the language of Allah, Allah is saying a pool of muddy water. So that's what he, he perceived, he saw it. So this is what it means. It doesn't mean a small pool. Mm -hmm. It could be an ocean. But yeah, where he but reached, he found it. So, so you, you found a pool, you found the ocean that looks like a pool. I mean, in the Arabic, does it say pool no, no, or yes. ocean? Oh, a spring of murky water, sorry. Then, to forgive you, uh, I must my son. I can ask, he's the Arabic speaking person. Yeah. Brother, ah, brother, one second. What's the, what's the word for pool here in Arabic? Oh, spring. Pool. What's the word of pool? Are you spring of uh, uh, pool? Yeah, no, 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 pool. Spring. A spring of murky water. What's a spring? Where's the spring? Behind I mean, I mean, it means yeah. spring, yeah? Yeah. yeah. See, so, so when since it's a spring, 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 like is, a spring is a water. Yeah, but it doesn't no, look like no, ocean. No, no, hang on a minute. I'm saying that the commentator is saying that. Hmm? Some commentators say that it was a sea or ocean. Some commentators say that. Mm -hmm. But neither no, none. No, 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 no. You neither Hadith no, no. say that, no, no. neither Quran say that. Brother, that. The man's word is different. You know, I mean, what means the word? Yeah, what is it? Mean? When you see, uh, you see uh, the, some Vulcan in, uh, in a rock and in the water, yeah, yeah. he do like a, a leak in the sea. Yeah. Okay. The hot that, water. Yeah, hot water. And he, he have what he have seen, he have seen there. He go with his military, he have seen the sea, he stopped. Sea. And then the sea. sea. Yeah, some and say see, the sea. Like one one small island, one island there yeah, yeah. have this uh, vulcan erupting. Okay. And he saying to you what I have seen. That's yeah, it. That's what, that's what Quran says. That's what he saw. Right. So, so, so after all of this. So it doesn't matter what size what it is. Was it sea or was it small? But whatever he can see, he couldn't see anything further than that. Okay. So, so the impression I'm getting now is that you come up with this description, and well, thank you for finding the hadith because I, I didn't have to go there. Yeah, three, three of these. Yeah, yeah. But you said one more. Muhammad said that. One. So but, two, two others say that it's not. And right. Mahathir. Those who are expert in hadith, they say the chain of narration in the one is weak, the other two are stronger. Right. So that's what they say. But what we're saying that hadith is not a word of God. Mm -hmm. Hadith can have errors in it. But Quran has no error in it. Nowhere Allah says in the Quran or that Allah will protect the hadith. Allah says in the Quran, we have revealed it and we are going to be the guard of it. So we do not take responsibility of our hadith. They are these, they are weak, they are mid, mid, in the middle and they are authentic. So we can't, we can't, if any hadith goes against Quran, we reject the hadith.